beautiful painting upstairs, which is about the signing of the Declaration of Independence. And we're standing at the 1739 Colony House at the head of Washington. Let's give credit where credit is due. Is the statement giving credit where credit is due? It was two months before the, the Declaration of Independence. This document of the General Assembly of the State of Rhode Island reached mankind. This was the first action of a General Assembly in the name of liberty, in the name of freeing ourselves from the allegiance we had to the despicable George III. And allow me to state it, as an act of allegiance, this dissolved for this reason, whereas George III, King of Great Britain, forgetting his dignity, regardless of the compact most solemnly entered into, ratified and confirmed to the inhabitants of this colony by his illustrious ancestors until of late fully recognized by him and entirely departing from the duties and character of a good king, instead of protecting, is endeavoring to destroy the good people of this colony and of all the United Colonies by sending fleets and armies to America to confiscate our property and spread fire, sword, and desolation throughout our country in order to compel us to submit to the most debasing and detestable tyranny, whereby we are obliged by necessity and it becomes our highest duty to use every means with which God and nature have furnished us in support of our invaluable rights of, and privileges to oppose the power which is exercised only for us, our destruction, therefore repeal the act of allegiance hereby.